just finished up finals here at CU, and it is clear that Adderall, Ritalin, and other drugs typically prescribed for ADHD are being highly abused. I went around and talked to my peers to find out more. I'm currently prescribed Adderall and I take it every day because I need to. I take like 40 to 50 milligrams a day, which is kind of on the higher end, but um, it's just, like especially during finals time, it's just funny because like, it seems like people who just have my number and I'm not even friends with, like all of a sudden they'll send me texts being like, hey, what's up? Oh, by the way, I think you can hook me up with some Adderall. No, it just seems like even like going into the bathrooms at the library, I like see people snorting Adderall all the time. Like the whole Adderall epidemic is getting out of control because the reason why people take Adderall is to get on um, the same like playing level as other students. And so when students who don't need to take Adderall take it, it gives us a, dif a disadvantage. I know a lot of girls who rely on Adderall to decrease their appetite and just not eat at all. Um, and I, I, people really do lose weight. And they say it takes away your appetite. It really does. I also think that um, Adderall has been recently used uh, before going out at night. Well, you've heard it all. And there clearly seems to be a problem here at CU's campus and probably at most other campuses nationwide. For Flesher.net, I'm Maggie McGreevy.